Oh, that's, that's mine. Yeah, why, why is this here? Those, those numbers are wrong. Every morning, DJ Ellis starts off his day by arriving four hours early to work at the Carnoustian Center in Bridgeport, Connecticut. The reason why I hired him, he provided five months of uh, community service here at the center. He was volunteering his time. He wanted to give back to the kids here at the center. Um, he showed me as an, a volunteer that he was really, really, really ready to be a staff member. Um, and we brought him on and uh, he's done tremendously with the age group that he worked with closely. DJ devotes a lot of his time as a counselor and mentor by helping the kids with their schoolwork. But when he is not with the kids, he is in the gym, developing his own body and the body of his clients as a personal trainer. Um, what inspired me to become a personal trainer was um, the fact that in growing up, I'd always been very physically active. I worked out a lot. Um, did a lot of push-ups growing up, sit-ups. I always try to keep my body in shape. Um, it's something I just never realized I had a hobby in doing until I realized I could pursue it as a career. When not in the classroom with the children, DJ is joking around with some coworkers or in the gym promoting physical activity by playing four square with the kids. Yay! Yeah! I can't hear you. Yeah! Helping kids and inspiring them every day here, it makes me feel good because it's another way to give back. Um, a lot of young adults, um, teenagers, even older adult parents, they don't realize how much younger kids, especially our youth, need role models in their lives. They may not always have the right ones around them that they need. And being here to help them see that, you know, just because times are hard or things may not be going your way or, you know, you need a good laugh, like being able to hear, being able to be here to give them that is, it makes me happy. I know it makes a lot of other people who work here happy as well. But just to see that look on their faces, like when they understand something or they're happy or they're laughing, that's what drives me, makes me feel good about myself. DJ as a trainer, well, I've known DJ for a long time, so he's a really good friend, but as a trainer, he's very professional and he pushes you way past your limits, which can be bad at first, but I mean, you get used to it and you learn new things and he's always like there telling you um, what to do and giving you good words of encouragement. Even with such a busy schedule, DJ manages to make time to work out himself as well as plan regimens for his clients. How do you feel about DJ as a counselor? I feel really good, he's like the best, he's like that's why I ever had. Why? Oh, because he gives all of us like extra time to do stuff, and he gives us candy to yeah. be good. Don't give up on your dreams. Um, there's more than one way around it. Um, I used to limit myself on that, um, as far as thinking I could only do one thing in life and it could only be this way. But as I've grown up more, I've experienced more life. Um, just realizing through dead ends that there's other ways around it to make your dreams a reality. You can do it, um, despite what it may seem like or what people may tell you, can be done only through God though. Every day, DJ continues to spend long hours in the Sheehan Center as a counselor, mentor, and personal trainer. He is working harder than ever to reach his dream one rep at a time. Welcome, Welcome to, to the Cardinal Sheen Center. Center. Where dreams come true. <laughs>